Imagine if the oceans were free of microplastics thanks to the efforts of a robotic fish. One has finally been created, and it's a working model of the winning idea from the inaugural Natural Robotics Contest. The Natural Robots Contest, announced in May by the University of Surrey, seeks public submissions of ideas for animal or plant-inspired robots that can carry out humanitarian tasks. The plan called for a panel of experts from various research institutions in the UK and Europe to deliberate over the concepts and decide on the one that would be developed into a working prototype. Engineers would then advance the technology, and non-experts could do the same by downloading the device's open-source blueprints. Eleanor McIntosh, a chemistry major at the University of Surrey, created the winning entry, a plastic gathering robofish. The robot uses tail flapping motions to propel itself through water, while simultaneously filling an internal cavity with water and microplastics. When it's full, the bot seals its mouth, opens its gill flaps like louvers, and raises the floor of the cavity to force the water out. The gill flaps are equipped with a fine mesh that lets water through but traps the plastic debris. The RoboFish, which currently measures 50 centimeters, 19.7 inches in length, can currently collect particles as small as 2 millimeters in diameter. It uses an IMU, inertial measurement unit, to keep tabs on its position in the water, and onboard sensors to check the turbidity and the underwater light levels, and it gives off a glow in the dark. However, it is possible that subsequent iterations will be able to capture even smaller particles. The current prototype swims in response to a hardwired remote, but a faster, more hydrodynamic body shape, a stronger tail, and autonomous swimming capability are all possible enhancements. That's it for today, and as always, make sure to like, subscribe, and check our website at www.techwiki.co. Thanks for watching.